the Fox 61 Weather Watch with meteorologist Ryan Bratton. As a dear old friend would say often when we were on TV together to weathermen, no waiting. <laughs> Brian Breton joins us with the forecast. Happy Christmas. Same to you. Thanks for coming in. No, delighted nice. to be here. Uh, a little foggy on the way into the station uh, this evening. I have a feeling that's going to be out there all night. It will be. We'll have areas of fog. And there was a little mist and drizzle during the day today. Mm -hmm. But fortunately, no steady rain. So just got to keep an eye out for the fog. And we're continuing to watch Santa, too. Of course, the big news. <laughs> now over the continental U.S. Take a look at the latest update here. The tracker puts him over Atlanta, Georgia at this point. So hopefully those southerners got the kids to bed early. And my thinking is he's working his way up the east coast. So we will keep you posted on the progress here over the next hour or so. Wanted to show you the current snow depth. Of course, it's not a white Christmas, not even close anywhere in southern New England. Some of the mountains in northern New England have been able to maintain some snow despite all the rain we've seen. But look at how much of the country where there's just nothing on the ground, even many Minneapolis, it will not be a white Christmas there this year. Maybe a little bit of a gray Christmas, though, with the fog. A dense fog advisory upper Tallinn and Wyndham counties through 9 o'clock in the morning. But even outside there, there will be some areas of dense fog. You can see in Chester the visibility now down to zero. So in some patches, that fog will be dense. It is mild enough, though, that we're not concerned about any freezing tonight. Temperatures will be staying above freezing through the night. The problem is we really don't have any wind to kick the fog and low clouds out. And we're going to stay in this pattern here for the next couple of days. So don't expect much sunshine uh, to come here these next few days. And there goes Santa and your forecast for tonight calling for mostly cloudy skies, areas of fog continuing, but temperatures that will be above freezing. So we're not worried about any icy spots. Areas of fog tomorrow morning, otherwise sticking with a lot of clouds, temperatures in the 40s to around 50, likely warmest along the shore where we may pop into the low 50s. So you can see here it's a cloudy and foggy start and we'll try to break away these low clouds and at least get some sunshine here and there. It won't be evenly distributed. Uh, some places will be stuck in the clouds all day, while others will see more breaks of sun. Tomorrow night we start clear, but I think the fog will fill back in tomorrow night. So plan on another foggy start to the day on Tuesday as well, with pretty similar similar temperatures. Highs on Tuesday, either side of 50 degrees. So another gray start Tuesday and a lot of clouds through the day, but we're not expecting any rain on Tuesday. That will start to change as we have a system developing to our south. Could be a few showers that come in Tuesday night, but it's really going to be Wednesday afternoon and Wednesday night that this next surge of rain comes through. The good news is it doesn't look as strong or as intense as the last couple of storms. So we're looking at probably about a half an inch to an inch of rain in most spots. There could be a few locally higher amounts. Should be able to manage this, but we'll keep you posted on the progress over these next couple of days. Take a look at your next seven. Tomorrow it's mostly cloudy. Again, some fog in the morning and be careful if you're out there tonight or early tomorrow morning, upper 40s to low 50s. Another foggy start on Tuesday, otherwise a cloudy day. Rain develops for Wednesday afternoon and night. A few lingering showers on Thursday. Forecast toward the end of the week looks cooler and likely dry. There will be a system offshore. We'll have to see how it pans out. But right now, New Year's Eve looking pretty good. We'll see you with another check coming up at 1030. Matt. Looking forward to a 